Well, most people who are watching Christian TV lately will see that on the bottom of the screen there's been this red warning asking people to change frequency and uh, at the top there's been a suggestion that you call for technical help. Well, I'm going to give you some technical help. This is uh, for those people who might have a digital video broadcasting set-top box, a DVB or it might have another label on it called PSA 2820 so um, I'm going to show you how to get into the menu on one of these uh, DVB machines and uh, change the frequency which is what we need to do to get the new channels that will be possibly higher definition in the future so first of all you need to get uh, the remote for the set-top box there's the DVD remote and um, we're going to press on the menu button which is just here the menu button on just to the bottom corner of the OK and go into the menu once you get into the menu on the DVB set-top box press OK on installation and then press OK on channel scan and here you'll see that uh, it's a on Optus B3 satellite which is now called Optus D2 don't take any notice of that it has an LMB frequency of 11300 I don't change any of these figures but I want you to go down to that transponder one and here we're going to edit the transponder and it says at the bottom of the screen there and edit TP if you press the blue button on the bottom see the blue button there on the bottom of the uh, so here we are now they've asked us to put in a new a transponder so we're going to do that now and pressing on the numbers on your remote uh, with that 1264 highlighted press in 1 2 5 1 9 um, leaving the symbol rate 22500 polarization is vertical keep scrolling down with the buttons that are around the OK button see those four around the OK you scroll down with those and there's OK and we press OK on that and so we've changed that 12644 into a 12519 that's how you change the frequencies now we're going to go down and scan in a new channel so we go down to scan type you don't want scan all because you'll get in stuff you've got to pay for so we're using the the button on the side of the OK press it there to get to free until you get FTA free to air uh, channels we'll, we'll go down another level and go down to the next one scan mode TP and now we go down to start the scan and press OK on that and we'll see what that new um, frequency has brought in and has brought in a few so we're now going to view them so taking the little button to the left of the OK button you'll take that across highlighting view channel now press OK and here we are we've got the new TBN channel without the red line underneath it so that's good means we've got uh, uh, some channels that are going to continue into the future but we've got too many as you'll see there's uh, there's another one number 79 we've got too many and we've got to get rid of those that we don't want so now we're going back into menu and we're going down to um, edit the channels see that edit the channels there edit TV channel press OK on that now we're going to delete a few we're going to delete all those we don't want so we'll try going over the no oh, look at them they go up for miles um, we'll go as high as we can go and then we'll come back Oh, here we're right at the top starting at number one leave that there when we want to delete one we'll press the red uh, we're in delete mode now so we'll put an OK by things we don't want so CGN we don't want that uh, delete channel CGN yes we want to delete that uh, press OK this is an AO1 AO N channel we don't need because it's on the old um, so we'll get rid of that as well delete and we've got to go across and do this all the way through till we get all the ones out we don't want there 
uh, seating on um, go across say yes so you delete all the ones you don't want in part is not any good to anybody uh, here anyhow these are channels that have got themselves in there from when we were looking at satellite oh well, I've gone jump, jumped a bit there don't want to delete those um, we want to get rid of all these here um, delete um, cross yes delete cross yes delete cross yes don't, don't want to delete that one we need to delete the one above it though delete cross yes delete cross yes okay now we want to keep these these are the new TBN channels one with a star alongside they're the new ones we just brought down in we want to keep them so you go through them all of the channels that you don't want and delete those you don't want to change the mode you go to your remote and there's a little red button on the bottom you press that and it'll shift that choice of the editing across to where you want it and we want to do some moving so we'll just leave it on move now and we take the channels to where we let's get the number one channel which we're going to press ok on that and you see the color change from bright yellow to almost orange now we take that down until it reaches number one position and press OK again and, and it will stay there. Uh, just have to believe it's there. OK on Daystar, take that to where you want it, want it number two, and that'll stay there. Then Church Channel, sorry not that one, uh, Church Channel, press OK, move it to number three, and so on until you get all the channels where you want them. God TV highlight that. Take it over the top, 64, 65, down to channel 4, and press OK on that. Um, inspiration, we'll put that in number 5. Now we've got 14 channels, which is all we'll need after we've deleted everything. We leave those last three in there because they're English speaking news channels. Okay, now we can exit out of all of that. Exit out of all of that. Exit out of all of that. Saving the details. Okay, now going from the top of the screen, we've got a TBN, um, Daystar, Church TV. You notice they've all got an asterisk, and that means that they're picking it up on that new transponder. And if you check the details under each channel, it's 2519, that's the one we put, punched in. And this one's 2706, doesn't have an asterisk, doesn't matter. So they're all there. Press TV, uh, HK, turn back to TBN. So we've now edited that box, and that's if you have a DVB uh, set-top box, that's how you do it.